SEC with green light for multiple spot Ethereum ETFs, launch expected in less than two hours. Hassan Shitu last updated. July 23, 2024 at 1550 GMT3, two minutes read. In a landmark decision, the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission, SEC, issued an effectiveness notice for S-1 applications from multiple financial giants. Approving the launch of several spot Ethereum exchange traded funds, ETFs launch. These ETFs, set to begin trading in less than two hours, represent a significant step forward in integrating cryptocurrency into mainstream. Financial markets. After being debated for a long time, it's finally going mainstream. Immediate trading start, the long-awaited spot EIC ETF launching soonest. The SEC's decision has set the stage for these ETFs to begin trading within the next two hours, creating excitement in the financial markets. The rapid rollout highlights these major financial firms' extensive preparation and eagerness to offer a regulated means of investing in Ethereum, a significant milestone for both retail and institutional investors. Several insider outlets have reported this groundbreaking development in a timely manner. Among them, BSCN headlines shared in a tweet that quickly garnered attention. The SEC's issuance of the effectiveness notice for the S1 applications means that these ETFs have met all regulatory requirements, allowing them to proceed to the market without further delay. These include major players such as BlackRock, Grayscale, Bitwise, 21 Shares, Vanek, Invesco, Galaxy, and Fidelity. Just minutes after the initial tweet, an update reinforced the immediacy of the situation. Update, Ethereum spot ETFs launching in less than two hours. The crypto market is now on. High alert as investors prepare for the official trading debut of these ETFs. Various thought leaders have claimed that swiftly bringing these innovative financial products to market requires a well-coordinated effort. And as it appears, it seemed to be. SEC finally paves the way for crypto exposure. This SEC's approval decision comes after weeks of registration statement revisions with issuers like 21 shares Bitwise, BlackRock, Fidelity, Franklin Templeton, Vanek, and Invesco Galaxy receiving the green light. Additionally, the Grayscale Ethereum Trust and the Grayscale Ethereum Mini Trust have gotten approval for their forms. The final S1 registration statements for these ETFs, which will be listed on major stock exchanges such as NASDAQ, NYSE, and CBOE, were approved on July. 22. These spot Ether ETFs will offer varying management fees, with most ranging from 0.15% to 0.25%. Bitwise will offer a competitive 0.2% fee, with an initial discount for the first $500 million in assets, contrasting with Grayscale's higher fee of 2.5% and BlackRock's 0.25 fee. Fidelity, 21 shares, Franklin Templeton and Vanek have announced fee waivers for certain periods or until their products reach specific net asset thresholds. It is worth mentioning that retail investors will also be able to purchase these Ether ETFs through brokerages like Robinhood and Fidelity, potentially increasing institutional demand and driving Ethereum's price higher. NYSE Arca has also confirmed the listing and trading approval for ETFs from Grayscale and Bitwise, while the CBOE has approved ETFs from Fidelity, Franklin Templeton, Invesco, 21 Shares, and Vanek. This regulatory acceptance involves a two-step procedure. The SEC first approved 19B-4 to forms in May, followed by the final step of allowing the registration statements to become effective. The introduction of these ETFs could pave the way for additional cryptocurrency-related financial products. Analysts predict that the launch of Ether ETFs might lead to other altcoin ETFs and potentially drive EEA to unprecedented price levels. The launch represents a significant opportunity for institutional and retail investors to diversify their portfolios with Ethereum assets under a regulatory framework. Follow us on Google News.